I'm gonna be showing you guys the full story of my creepy teacher. From when he first stalked me to when he asked me to be his valentines, and finally when he kidnapped and tried to brainwash me. Make sure you get some popcorn and watch the full video because you don't want to miss what happened. Guys, I'm in music class right now, and I have the strictest music teacher ever. She almost never lets you go to the bathroom, and I have to use the bathroom right now. I'm so scared to ask her because she could be rude sometimes, but I really, really, really need to go. I'm gonna be super nice and say, Miss Teacher? She said yes. Okay, okay. She's not being too mean just yet. Can I use the restroom, please? She said, well, I don't know. Music is really important. Okay, I promise to play guitar super, super well when I get back, but I just have to go, like, right now. She said, I'd hate for you to miss class. I'll be super fast, like, less than five minutes. Please, please, please let me go. Just this once, Brooke. Oh, thank God. I'm going, I'm going, I'm going. I was so lucky for her to say yes. She almost never does, and I always have to sit and wait until the next class. Oh, there's Mr. Ross. He's always super, super nice to me. He said, hi, Brooke. How are you? I'm doing amazing, but I actually have to use the bathroom, like, really, really bad. He said, I'll need to see a hall pass. Okay, I have one right here. And give it to him. Oh, I really hope he hurries up and looks at my hall pass because I have to go, like, right now. Please hurry, please hurry. Wait, he just put my hall pass away. He said, I don't see a hall pass, smiley face. Oh my gosh, you're just joking, right? This guy is such a kidder. He said, I've been meeting to speak to you. Oh, can this go super quick? I have to go. He said, your grades are kind of slipping in my class. Um, that's not right, but can we hurry up, please? I have to use the bathroom. I'll need to talk to you about it later. Okay, we can talk later. I promise I'll talk to you after school. He said, well, I guess I can let a pretty girl like you go this one time, but before you go, he's kind of acting a little weird right now. I have a special pass for students I consider my friends winky face. Okay, well, I'm gonna use the hall pass I have right now to go to the bathroom. I'll talk to you later, Mr. Ross. Okay, that whole conversation was really weird. What was he talking about when he said he had a special pass and only for students he consider his friends? Aren't all students supposed to be his friend? Anyway, I gotta get back to class. My music teacher's gonna be so mad. Oh, wait, there's Mr. Ross. Man, I really don't feel like talking to him again. Wait, he's down here with another student? She said, have my grades gone up yet, daddy? He said, well, I'm not sure you've earned that yet. Wait, is that Mr. Ross? She said, well, what else do I need to do, daddy? Wait, why is this girl calling him daddy? What kind of sus stuff is going on here? He said, for one, you could see me after school today. You better hurry back to class, cutie. That cannot be Mr. Ross talking to a student right now. She said, see you later, winky face. Um, I don't want to have to walk past him. Is he going to go back to class too? Okay, okay, he's leaving, he's leaving. I don't know what I just saw. That was super weird. Oh, and there's Gabby. Gabby, Gabby, you will never believe what I just saw. She said, what is it? I'm going to say, I saw Mr. Ross being really sus earlier. She said, but Mr. Ross is always so sweet. Well, um, he wasn't really being sweet then. He was talking to another student in a really weird way. She said, are you sure it was Mr. Ross? I am 100% positive. I've never seen him talk to a student like that. Girl, the bell just rang, and I think our next class is with Mr. Ross. She said, you don't need to be worrying, Brooke, but what if he is being weird? I don't want to be in the same class as him. She said, calm down. Okay, maybe I should calm down. Maybe it was something that wasn't actually sus. She said, it's probably not what it looked like. Okay, you're probably right. Let's just go to class. Hold on, before we go to class, let's take a snap real quick. I'm gonna put hashtag besties. Okay, I better get to class before I get in trouble for having my phone out. Um, okay, there's Mr. Ross. I'm just gonna go ahead and sit over here next to Gabby so I feel more comfortable. Gabby, I think I'm gonna keep an eye on Mr. Ross and see if I notice anything else that's super sus about him. Gabby said, I think you're just wasting your time, smiley face. Well, he's kind of weirding me out right now, so I guess we'll find out. Mr. Ross says, please turn in your homework at the front desk. Oh, this is perfect. I worked so hard on my math homework, and I'm pretty sure I aced this test. Okay, Mr. Ross, here you go. He said, Brooke, I'm gonna need to talk to you later about those grades. Uh, what is he talking about? My grades have been perfectly fine. He's being super creepy. I'm just gonna go sit down. Gabby, Mr. Ross says he wants to see me in private to talk about my grades later. What do you think that means? Gabby said he's such a nice guy. I think you're just being dramatic, smiley face. But what if I'm not being dramatic? What if he is being super creepy? He gave me a winky face. What teacher does that? He said, Brooke, can I speak to you for a moment? But I was just over here. Yes, what is it? He said, as I said earlier, your grades are slipping. I don't see how my grades could be slipping. I've been doing perfectly fine. What are you talking about? He said, I have some low grades here, dot, dot, dot. But there are ways you can get extra credit, winky face. Wait, what do you mean by extra credit? And what is my grade in this class right now? He said, well, let's just say you're close to failing this class. But I can't be failing. I'm so good at math. Not as good as the other girls, dot, dot, dot. Okay, well, I know Gabby personally, and I know for a fact that she is not good at math. I'm sure we can work something out if you're willing to meet me after school, winky face. Um, okay, okay. I don't want to make 
make him upset, so I'll talk to him later about my grades. I'm just gonna go sit back down. Gabby, I just had the weirdest conversation with Mr. Ross. He wants to meet after school later to talk about my grades? She said I'm sure he was just being nice. Girl, there's a difference between just being nice and being a little creepy. He was giving me a ton of winky faces, and he's never done that before. She said I think you need to calm down, girl. He's just a nice teacher. Okay, well, I'm gonna try to get proof and show you what I'm talking about. There is something weird going on with him. Look at him. He's just sitting over there with a weird look on his face. Okay, I'm thinking that Gabby was right, and maybe I was just getting a little too carried away with the sussy Mr. Ross stuff. Girl, this food is on point today. I am so hungry. Hold on a second. I just got a snap. Wait, it's from Mr. Ross? He said, looking forward to seeing you after school, winky face? Girl, look at what Mr. Ross just sent me. She said, oh, that's a cute picture. No, it's not. He's being literally creepy. Do you see that look on his face? He said, looking forward to meeting you later after school. Does that not seem sus to you? She said, he's a sweet guy. Girl, what is wrong with you? That is more than just being sweet. That is being super creepy. Okay, I'll talk to you later. I need to go to his class to figure this out right now. Guys, I don't know what that stuff was about. Maybe it was just a big misunderstanding because he's always been so nice to me. <gasps> is that the girl from earlier with Mr. Ross again? He said, I've been waiting all day to see you. Guys, I knew something sus was going on with Mr. Ross. She said, I'm ready to earn those grades, daddy. Is she really calling him daddy to boost her grades? He said, I love it when you call me daddy. What kind of sus stuff is going on here, guys? Have you thought about my offer? Uh... What offer is he talking about? I'm ready to do whatever it takes. And they're getting super close for a kiss. Oh my gosh. Guys, I knew Mr. Ross was up to something super weird. I told Gabby I was gonna get proof and this is exactly what I needed. I'm gonna take a snap of this right now. This is perfect. I'm gonna show this to Gabby, but I need to go to the principal's office right now. Oh my gosh, guys. Math class is literally right next to the principal's office. Mr. Ross was doing all that sus stuff right next to the principal. Okay, I have to go tell her exactly what I saw. Oh, and thank God. She's in here. Miss Principal, I have something extremely important to tell you. Mr. Ross has been doing some really sus stuff with students lately, and I have proof. Look, on my phone right here, I took a picture of him and this other girl in his classroom. Why are they so close to each other? Do you think they're kissing? She said, I'm so glad you brought this to my attention. Oh, thank God she's gonna do something about it. I'll look into it, dot, dot, dot. Wait, why did she say it like that? She said, please wait here, Brooke. Wait, why are you gonna make me wait here? Where are you going? Um, guys, do you think that conversation was a little weird? She didn't ask me any more questions. She just left. I'm gonna go follow her. Where could she have gone? Maybe she went to the math class. Wait, she is in there with Mr. Ross. Okay, let's see how she handles this. She said we need to talk about something exclamation point. Okay, she sounds a little upset. This is good. Maybe he'll get in trouble. I have a student claiming she has evidence of you acting sus. Exactly. She's talking about me. Could be a real problem for you. Um, wait. Why does she say it like that? Isn't she gonna, like, fire him or call the police? He said, well then, I guess you'll have to take care of it. Winky face. Um, guys, is the principal in on this too? She said, of course, daddy. Wait, why are all these girls calling Mr. Ross daddy? And this girl even said, um, this guy here said dot, dot, dot. Why is he able to get away with this? He said, what student has this evidence? Oh no, she's gonna tell him that it's me. She said, it's Brooke, dot, dot, dot. Guys, I'm actually kind of scared now. He said, oh really? That's such a shame. I'll have to speak with her. Okay, guys, I better get out of school before Mr. Ross tries to come and find me. Whatever's going on with Mr. Ross, the principal is obviously in on it. Why does she not fire him or call the police? I'm just gonna go home and end this day. This has been absolutely crazy. Guys, we are finally back at home just chilling and watching TV. It was such a crazy school day. Gabby, I have something I want to show you. I took pictures of Mr. Ross today in class with another girl and they were acting super sus. Look at this picture. I think he's literally kissing her. She said, wow, dot, dot, dot. What do you mean, wow? Why did you say it like that? This is huge news. He could go to jail. She said I need to get going. Bye. Wait, why are you leaving so fast? Gabby? Guys, what is up with her? She didn't even question what Mr. Ross did. Today is just so weird. I need to go to bed. I'm gonna go upstairs and get ready. Okay, guys, I finally got into my pajamas and I am so tired and ready for bed. This room is so comfy. Wait, someone just snapped me this late at night? Um, guys, is that Mr. Ross outside of my window? He said we need to talk smiley face. Oh my god, he's right there. Okay, guys, it's time to go to school. Uh, 
wait a second. I just got a snap. Who in the world is snapping me this early in the morning? Oh my gosh, guys. That's Mr. Ross. He said last night was fun. I cannot believe Mr. Ross snapped me this early in the morning after what he did last night. You know what? I'm just gonna go to school and completely ignore it. This is ridiculous, guys. I'm just gonna try to make this an amazing day. There's no way I'm letting some sussy teacher mess with my life. Guys, I really wonder if I should talk to Mr. Ross about him showing up at my house last night and being super creepy. Wait a second. Wait a second. That's Mr. Ross and another girl. He said I missed you yesterday. She said you were so late, though. Oh my gosh, guys. Was he late because he was stalking on me at my house? He said I know I had to do something. Uh, yeah. You had to come to my house and act like a stalker. How about we meet up tonight? I can help you with your homework, Winky Face. Uh, guys, I don't think he's really gonna be helping her with her homework. She said I don't know. Girl, please do not let this guy come over to your house and help you with your homework. Mr. Ross said you have to improve your grades. If you don't, you will fail this class. He said you don't want to fail, do you? And then she said, I'm trying, but it's just so hard. And then he said, that's what I'm here for. I make it easy. Bro, you do not make anything easy. You're acting super sus lately. She said, I'm sorry, maybe another time. You go, girl. You just turned Mr. Ross down for acting super sussy. He said, come on, don't be shy. Hold on a sec, guys. I just got a snap. Come on, don't be snapping me right now. This is some good stuff. Wait a second. It's a new kid. He said, hello, I'm new here. Oh, wait, that's actually so cool. I'm gonna snap him back. I'm gonna say, welcome to our school with an exclamation point and a smiley face and sin. Okay, okay. I have to get back to figuring out what these two are talking about. She said, I have to go. Oh my gosh, she just walked away, guys. Wait, did she see me? Um, guys, it's literally two o'clock in the afternoon. I need to get to class. Uh, uh oh, guys, what is happening right now? He just said, hello, Brooke. Oh no, he literally saw me. I do not want to be in this situation right now, guys. He said, you don't have a Valentine's date, do you? Um, no, I don't actually. He said, well, I can be that date winky face and he's getting close to me, guys. I'm just gonna say, uh, I have to go to class. He said, not so fast, class can wait. Bro, I'm gonna be late if I don't go to class right now. Please let me go. He said, I need to talk to you about your grades. They're slipping. Wait a second, guys. I think he's lying because I'm literally great at math. He said, no, your grades are quite poor. You have to find a way to get them up. Bro, he just said, I'm willing to give a helping hand. Winky face. Okay, okay. I'm gonna say, what kind of help? He said, the kind of help that helps you pass my class. Guys, that's the sussiest thing I have ever heard. I'm literally gonna say, this isn't right. You're just using your grades to get whatever you want. I literally don't need your help. I'm great at math. He said, yes, you do, Brooke. You have to let me in. And he moved closer to me. Um, yeah, definitely not. He said, how about we talk about this tonight? Guys, does he mean after school? He wants to talk to me after school? He said, of course, winky face. Guys, to get him to leave me alone, I'm just gonna say, I'll have to think about it. He said, just remember, if you don't get your grades up, I'll have to call your parents. Dude, you would not call my parents over something that's literally a lie. He said, you know I would, Brooke. See you in class. Guys, this could not be happening to me right now. This is way too sussy. Hold on, guys. I just got another snap. It's that new kid again. He said, maybe you could show me around sometime. Okay, okay. I'm gonna reply to him and say, of course I can help you. And then I sent it to him. I love new kids in school. Okay, guys. On a more serious note, like and subscribe in the next five seconds if you think I should expose Mr. Ross. <laughs> Guys, I cannot believe he would actually use my parents against me. But I can tell you one thing. I am not gonna go see him after school. That's way too sus. I honestly don't understand why he's acting so weird lately. He used to be the sweetest teacher in the world. Okay, guys, I cannot keep messing around. I have to get to class or I'm gonna be late. Okay, guys, there's my bestie. Girl, I have to talk to you. She said, hey, girl, how are you? Gabby, what happened last night? Why did you just run out of my house like that? She said, oh, well, I just had to get home. Um, okay, that's a little weird. She said, why? Why? What's wrong? Girl, Mr. Ross came to my house after you left. He was literally at my back door, sending me snaps and acting super sussy. She said, what did he want? Girl, I just told you he sent me a creepy snap and he was being really weird. He threatened to tell my parents that my grades are slipping in. I don't know what to do. I'm trying to figure this out. Oh, and girl, get this. He even asked me to be his valentine. Oh, wait, speaking of which, I don't even have a valentine. What about you? She said, well, I have this one guy, dot, dot, dot. She said, but I don't 
think he's into me? Aw, I'm sorry, bestie, but what am I supposed to do about Mr. Ross? She said, I think you're overreacting. Gabby, you must be kidding, right? She said it's kind of hard to believe. Girl, the principal called him daddy. I showed you the picture. I don't understand why you don't believe me. Guys, I'm telling you, there's been some sussy stuff going on in this school, and it's so weird that Gabby doesn't trust me. Wait a second. She said the principal did what? I'll be right back. Wait, what? Where is she going? Guys, why is she acting so weird right now? Wait, Steve just asked if everything was okay? Um, I don't know. I think I have to be right back. Okay, Gabby, where the heck did you go? Did she go downstairs? Wait a second. Is that Mr. Ross talking to another girl again? He said you said you needed something? She said, yeah, rumor has it. You've been taking an interest in Brooke. Oh my god, guys, she's talking about me. And look, Steve is literally over here watching this too. He said, and so what if I have? I thought it was your one and only, and then she stepped closer to him. Oh my god, guys, how many girls does he have around him? He said, you are, don't worry about it. And then she said, I've missed you lately. Oh my gosh, guys, I have to get a better view. I'm gonna get right here to where they can't see me. She said, you aren't around as much. I was wondering, would you wanna be my Valentine's Day? Oh my god, guys, did she just ask a teacher to be her Valentine's Day? What the heck is happening in this school? He said, hmm, I can't. She said, why not? And then he said, I'm planning on getting someone. Oh my god, guys, I don't like the sound of that. He's already asked me to be his Valentine's Day, and now he's turning down another girl. She said, but, dot, dot, dot. And then he said, don't worry. How about we spend some time together? Guys, she literally said, I like the sound of that. Oh my god, this is so creepy. She said, when, question mark? And then he said, tomorrow night? And then she said, why not now? And oh my god, guys, she's literally crawling on his face. He said, you should get back to class. Oh my god, guys, is he kicking her off him? And then she said, okay, daddy. Guys, he said, I'll see you later. Okay, okay, I have to go back up here into the bathroom so he doesn't see me. Go, 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 go. What in the world did I just witness? Did another girl just call Mr. Ross daddy? Who in the world am I supposed to talk to about this? This is getting a little crazy. Okay, okay, I'm just gonna get out of here and go back to class before I end up being late. Um, oh my god, guys, wait a second. Mr. Ross is right outside in the bathroom. Bro, how creepy is this guy? He's literally everywhere. He said, where's your hall pass, Brooke? Uh-oh, guys, the teacher said she didn't have an extra hall pass, so I don't have one. He said, well, Brooke, what do you have to say for yourself? I literally just said the teacher didn't have an extra hall pass. And then he said, I've heard that before. Oh my god, guys, is he literally acting like I'm lying? He said, whatever you say, Brooke, I'm gonna have to call your parents. Guys, he did not just say this. He said, you've been very naughty lately, winky face, and then he moved closer to me. Why in the world did he say it like that? I cannot get in trouble right now with my school or my parents. Hold on, guys. Someone just snapped me. Guys, it's a new kid, Steve, and he said creepy guy alert. Oh my gosh, that's literally me and Mr. Ross. That is so true. Oh, and look, he's literally watching right there from in the classroom. He's seeing all of this. Mr. Ross said, look, Brooke, you're cute with a winky face, so I'll let you off the hook if you do a few things for me. Bro, he did not just say that. What the heck do you want? He said, I want you to be my Valentine's Day date, and he brought flowers, and I want you to call me daddy. Oh my gosh, guys, this is way too sus for me. He said, then you can go free. Bro, I am never gonna call you daddy. That is too weird, and I'm definitely not gonna be your Valentine's date. I'd rather be grounded for the rest of my life. Guys, he literally said, I'm sure that can be arranged. Is he threatening me right now? Oh my gosh, my science teacher just came out. Thank God. Steve, did you go get her? Oh my gosh, guys, I think I just got saved. She said, what is going on here? He said Miss Brooke is out without a hall pass. Oh my gosh, guys. I literally explained this to him. What is wrong with this guy? He said, I'm gonna have to call her parents. Okay, okay. My science teacher said, oh, that's not necessary. Thank you, thank you, thank you. She said, I didn't have an extra hall pass. Exactly. I told you. So I let her out of class to be back in five minutes. Guys, I can definitely tell you I've been out of class longer than five minutes. She said, you need to get back to class. Okay, okay. I'm so sorry. I got distracted. She said, it's quite all right. Just get back to class. Okay, guys, I have to go back in class before Mr. Ross decides to say something sussy. Guys, do you think Mr. Ross was just trying to make an excuse to get me alone with him? He could have left me alone without a hall pass. Okay, okay, the lunch bell just rang. I'm so excited for food. Guys, I do not know what to do about Mr. Ross, but he's acting way too sus, and I need to figure out what the heck is going on. Wait a second, Steve just came over here? He said you could always sneak into his house. Oh my god, bro, that's like the best idea ever. He said, sorry, dot, dot, dot. Guys, what is he apologizing for? He said, I could hear you talking, LOL. 
Well, oh my gosh, this is literally just fine. You gave me the best idea ever. Don't even worry about it. Oh, and I wanted to say thank you so much for saving me from Mr. Ross earlier. He said that guy is a teacher, right? Yeah, he's the school's math teacher and he's super sussy. He said they let him talk that way. Dude, I do not even know who lets him talk that way, but I know that the principal doesn't do anything about it. She calls him daddy too, and it's so weird. He said weird dot dot dot. Exactly. Okay, guys, I have to go home super fast and prepare on how I'm supposed to get into Mr. Ross's house. Okay, okay, guys, the first thing I have to do is go upstairs and change it to an outfit that's not my normal school clothes. And three, two, one. Perfect, guys. I'm dressed in all black. Nobody's gonna be able to see me in the dark, especially Mr. Ross. Actually, I'm gonna take a snap real quick before I leave. Okay, I'm gonna make sure to get my bed in the background and say, feeling cute. Might go expose someone tonight and post. Oh my gosh, guys, that was like the best post ever. My besties are gonna be like, what the heck was that about? Okay, guys, I think I am officially ready. Okay, guys, this is it. That's literally Mr. Ross's house. And look, you can see him inside right there through his window. Okay, okay, I have to make sure he doesn't see me. Obviously, I can't go through the front door, so I'm gonna have to figure out a way through the back. Guys, I cannot believe I'm about to sneak into someone's house. Okay, okay, let's see. Does he have an open door back here? Oh my gosh, guys, there's so many windows. I have to move super fast so he doesn't see me. Guys, he's literally standing right there. Oh my gosh, did this guy really just leave his back door open? This is too easy. Okay, okay, I'm gonna get super close and see if I can see what he's doing. Oh my god, I'm literally right inside his house. Wait a second, he said I really like this girl. I know she likes me too. Guys, who is he talking about? He's not talking about me, is he? He said, yes, I put cameras all over her house. Guys, I swear if he's talking about me, I'm gonna be so angry. He said that way I could find out what she really likes. Guys, I knew he wanted to be my Valentine's Day, but there's no way he put cameras in my house. He said, I don't say this very often, but oh my gosh, guys, he's moving. I have to make sure he doesn't see me. Okay, I'm gonna sneak into his house right over here. Guys, this is so perfect. Ain't no way he's gonna be able to see me. I'm super hidden. He said, thank you for all your help. I would never have gotten this far without you. Guys, who the heck is helping him set up cameras in my house? He said, of course, I'll make it up to you. There is no way he's acting this sussy. Oh my god, guys, my phone is ringing. I thought I turned it off. No, no, no. Oh my god, Mr. Ross said, wait a second, what was that? Go, 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 go. You better freaking run before he gets you. Oh my gosh, guys, I have to run out to the middle of the road. This is too creepy. I cannot stand that guy. I cannot believe I almost got caught. Okay, how the heck am I supposed to get out here? He's literally in his front door. Oh my gosh, guys, he's right there. Wait a second, is that Steve? He said, get in. Oh my gosh, okay, okay, I'm going. Guys, literally, Mr. Ross is right there. He said, Brooke with two exclamation points. Oh my god, guys, I cannot believe that happened. Steve literally just saved my life. Guys, I cannot believe we just escaped Mr. Ross's house. He was acting crazy and running after us. Thank you so much, Steve, for saving me. He said, you need to be more careful. Um, yeah, I do, because I keep attracting these sussy people. Guys, I can't even go home because Mr. Ross literally put cameras all in my house. Steve just said, where do you want to go? Um, guys, I don't have that many friends I could stay with. I'm gonna say, take me to Gabby's house. I'm sure she'll let me stay with her for a little while. Guys, I cannot stay with Steve because he's a boy. He said, I thought you were mad at her. I don't know what else to do. I obviously can't spend the night with you. That's just weird. Okay, guys, we're here. I really hope Gabby's gonna let me stay with her. Okay, I'm gonna say, thank you so much, Steve. You literally saved my life. He said, no problem, and he's driving away. Guys, that's all he said was NP. Are you serious? This kid is crazy. Hold on a second. My phone just dinged. Um, guys, it's Mr. Ross. He said, where are you going? Question mark. How in the world could he be snapping me right now? I just caught him saying some sussy stuff about me. Oh my god, guys. He literally snapped me again. He said, I know it was you at my house tonight. Oh my gosh, guys. I'm gonna get in so much trouble. This guy is way too sus. He won't leave me alone. Okay, guys. I'm just gonna go spam Gabby's doorbell just to let me stay the night. There's no way Mr. Ross is gonna know I'm at Gabby's. Hello? Is anybody home? Gabby, please open the door. Hurry, hurry, hurry. Oh my god, guys. There she is. Girl, you better open this door. She just said, oh, hey, bro. What are you doing here? Oh my god, guys. I don't even know what to say to her. Okay, okay. I'm gonna say, I need a place to stay in all caps with two exclamation points. She said, what's wrong with your house? I'm not so sure I forgive you. Um, guys, is she really gonna play these games with me right now? Can't she tell I'm in trouble? I'm literally showing up at her house in an all black outfit. This is a little sus. Okay, okay. I'm just gonna say, girl, stop playing games. This is important. She said, fine, you can come in. Oh my God, thank you, thank you, thank you. I'm literally gonna close these doors and lock it. There ain't no way Mr. Ross is getting in here. Hey guys, look, she has one of those cute little vacuums. Oh my God, that's so adorable. Okay, okay, Brooke, stay on track. Girl, you will not believe what 
what I'm about to tell you. I said I went to Mr. Ross's house. He's literally been stalking me, and he even put cameras in my house to watch me. Oh my god, guys. I just got a snap. Please don't be Mr. Ross. Oh my god. It literally is. He said, why are you playing games, Brooke? Make life easy for yourself. How is letting you be sus gonna make my life easier on me? You're just being creepy. Girl, I'm telling you, he's acting weird. He literally just sent me a sussy snap again. She said, why would he put cameras in your house? How would he even do that? Question mark. Girl, I don't know. Maybe he snuck in while I was sleeping. This guy is super creepy. All I know is I cannot have him running around town stalking me. Guys, why is Gabby acting so weird? I'm gonna say, girl, what happened to us? We used to be besties. She said we are besties, Brooke. Let's snap together like we used to. Um, guys, is she literally gonna take a snap right now in a time like this? Girl, my creepy teacher is stalking me. And I am in like the worst Snapchat outfit ever. Okay, guys, I'm gonna look at her snap real quick. She said hashtag friends forever. Uh, guys, does this seem a little creepy right now? She said, why don't you relax while I get us something to eat? Um, okay, I guess I could use something to eat. And you know what, guys? I literally have to get out of this black, ugly outfit. I'm gonna go into her closet right here and change. And boom, guys, it's so nice to get out of those ugly black clothes and back into my cute outfit. Guys, I'm gonna be honest. Even if sus stuff is going on, I still wanna look cute while it's happening. Oh my god, guys. I literally just got another snap from him. He said, daddy wants his baby girl. Guys, there's no way he's sending this sussy stuff to me. I cannot handle this. So like and subscribe right now if you think I should follow Gabby and see what she's doing. Okay, okay. I'm just gonna go out here and see what Gabby's doing. She's acting a little sus, honestly. Um, hello. Where's Gabby? Wait a second. She put food on the table, but she's outside on the balcony. Uh, guys, I think I'm gonna be a little bit of a stalker and come over here and watch her. Wait a second. Gabby just said, what happened? Question mark. Look, she's literally on her phone. She said, did you get the photo? She just showed up. She knows you put cameras in her home. Um, guys, is she talking to who I think she's talking to right now? She's literally on the phone with Mr. Ross. Why in the world would Gabby be involved with that creep? And how does she know that he put cameras in my house? Okay, okay. Let's see what else she has to say. She said, why do you want her? Question mark. Brooke is still my friend. She said, okay, I'll talk to her butt dot dot dot. I better be the one or else. And then she just said, yeah, yeah. Odors above all. And then she just ended her call. Oh my God, guys. I gotta, I gotta get over here and eat lunch. Go, 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 go. Uh, don't mind me. I'm just sitting here eating lunch. Guys, what the heck was she talking about with him? Why does she say odors above all? What is that? Oh no, she's literally sitting right next to me. Bro, she literally just asked, how are you doing? Question mark. She said, I made you some food. Uh, yeah, I can see that. How does it taste? Um, I'm just gonna say, I don't know if I can eat right now. I feel sick all of a sudden. Guys, I cannot eat the food she made for me. I don't know what she did with it. Wait a second. She just said, I think you should eat, Brooke, in all caps. It will make you feel better. Smiley face. Guys, is that not creepy what she just said? Or am I going crazy? I'm just gonna say, uh, okay, Gabby, sure. I guess I'll sit down and eat my chicken. There you go, Gabby. I just ate some of your food. She said, eat more in all caps. Girl, I am so full. Why are you upset right now? She said, I'm sorry, Brooke. I'm worried about you. Bro, me and you both know that that's literally a lie, guys. She was just talking to Mr. Ross out on the balcony. She said, you scare me sometimes. Girl, you're scaring me right now. Okay, okay. I'm just gonna say, what do you mean? How in the heck do I scare you? She said, you're always worried about Mr. Ross. You think he's after you. Uh, girl, it's because he is after me. She just said, sure he is. Dot, dot, dot. Guys, she's literally trying to manipulate me. She knows he's after me. I'm just gonna say, that is it, Gabby. I'm literally leaving. I don't care if he has cameras in my house. I just wanna go home and be safe in my own home. I'm gonna open the door and go outside. Oh my god, who the heck is that? Dude, it's Mr. Ross. He said, where are you going? Guys, I cannot believe this is happening right now. He's literally at Gabby's house. He's getting super close to me. I'm gonna say, Mr. Ross, what the heck are you doing here? He said, Gabby is worried about you. I'm worried about you. He said, let us help you. And he's moving super close to me. Oh my gosh, guys. Um, he just closed the door and locked it. Gabby, I thought you were my bestie. Why would you do something like this to me? She said, I am your friend. This is what's best for you. Soon you will be like me. You will see Mr. Ross like I do. Girl, he's literally a creepy old man. She said, once you get your chip, you will see. Um, guys, I think this is way sussier than what I even thought it was. What the heck does she mean? I'll get my chip.
ship. She said it's not so bad being an odor. Um, guys, is this some kind of odor cult or something? What is happening right now? She said it makes you feel really good as she's jumping up and down. Guys, who the heck is this? Because this is not my bestie. He said soon, dot, dot, dot. The doctor will be here. Doctor? What doctor? I'm not letting you put some weird chip in me. He just said once you have your chip, everything will be better. He just said let's go sit in the living room. Oh my god, guys. I don't think I have a choice but to go sit down. This is getting way too creepy. Okay, bro. You better stop standing super close to me. I'm getting a little weirded out. Oh my gosh, guys. Mr. Ross is literally standing right next to me. I am moving seats. There is no way I'm standing that close to that creepy old man. Guys, the doorbell just rang. Oh my god. Who the heck is that? He said that must be her now. Guys, who the heck is he talking about? Is he talking about the doctor? He just said get the door, Gabby. And Gabby just walked away to open the door. Girl, don't do it. Oh my gosh. She literally just did it. I was too late to say that. Why are you doing this to me, Mr. Ross? Why can't you just act like a normal math teacher? He said you were a very special girl. I have big plans for you. What are you talking about? I do not want to be a part of your big plans. He said you have a role to play. Don't fight it. Soon you will be my wife. Oh my god, guys. Did he just say that? He wants me to be his wife? You're joking, right? There's no way I will ever marry you. He said soon, dot, dot, dot. You will do anything I want. Guys, I have to find a way to get out of here. This cannot be happening to me right now. This is way too sus. Um, who in the world is that? He said, thank you for coming so quickly, doctor. Wait, this is the doctor? That dude looks like he's wearing a Halloween costume. He said, I'm happy to help out my favorite student. Wait a second, is he talking about me? Odors above all. Guys, that's a weird saying Gabby said earlier. Is this really some kind of odor clan? He said, so this is the lucky girl. I was telling you about. Guys, why is he so obsessed with me? This is so weird. Gabby just said, I thought I was dot, dot, dot. You lied to me. Guys, is Gabby jealous because this creepy teacher is all over me and not her? Girl, she literally left it right out on her balcony. Oh my god. He just said, let's get her ready. Uh-uh. Nobody's coming near me and touching me. You better back up before I kick you in the knee. Guys, they're literally both standing right in front of me. What am I supposed to do? The doctor just said, wait, dot, dot, dot. What is Gabby doing? Wait a second. Where's Gabby? Oh my god, guys. There's Gabby. She's got a gun. She said no one move a muscle. Um, guys, I think this is getting a little too crazy. Mr. Ross just said, babe, what are you doing? Did he just call Gabby babe? She said, don't babe me. You picked Brooke. You said it would be me. Guys, she really is jealous that this creepy teacher is all over me. He said, don't do this, Gabby. And she said, Brooke, come on, let's go. Oh my god, guys. I'm literally getting behind Gabby. She's the one with the gun. He said, remember odors above all. All. She just said no dot dot dot. No more odors above all. She said we're leaving Brooke. Oh my god, Bestie, let's get the heck out of here. There's no way I'm standing around this creepy teacher and creepy doctor. Girl, open the door. Open the door. Go, 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 go. Oh my god, thank you so much, Gabby. You literally saved me. Girl, what implant was he talking about? Do you have an implant? She said no, the chip is only for select people. Girl, why would you help him then? Oh my god, guys, I just got a snap. It's from Mr. Ross. He said, where are you going question mark guys he literally sent another one with a doctor in the background he said get back here now we have plans for you oh my gosh girl we have to get out of here as quick as possible she just said my whole life is messed up dot 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 he said he cared about me brooke i'm so dumb how did i let myself be fooled by him girl we gotta get out of here we'll talk later oh my god gabby literally drive he's coming down the driveway go 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 bro he's literally right there watching us run away girl it's not your fault that he took advantage of you he's just a creepy guy Guys, let's go to the police. Mr. Ross has to pay for what he just did to us. Okay, guys, we just got to the police station. Please let there be an officer in here. Oh my gosh, there is. Okay, girl, we are literally saved. I'm gonna say, we need help in all caps with three exclamation points. He said, what's the problem? Okay, okay, I'm just gonna say, my teacher is an odor and he kidnapped me. Look at the photos he sent me. Look at how sus these are. He said, hold on a sec, dot, dot, dot. I need to make a call. Bro, I just showed you my creepy teacher and you need to go make a phone call. Wait a second. Gabby just said he just sent me a snap. He said I have to bring you back or else. Guys, the police officer is coming out. He said I need you to come with me. Wait, are you gonna protect us? Mr. Ross may try to come get us. He said don't worry about him. He just wants what's best for you. Um, what the heck are you talking about? Once you get the chip, everything will be better. I love mine. Oh my god, guys. This is not happening right now. Gabby just said he's one of them. Dot, dot, dot. He just said odors above all 
all soon? You will know? Gabby, we have to make a run for it. We have to go get help. She said, I'll get his attention while you go for help. Girl, what are you gonna do? Once I have his attention, make a run for it, uh, guys. Oh my god, his back is literally turned. I gotta go, go, go. Guys, I'm gonna take her car and come back for Gabby later. I have no idea where I'm supposed to go for help. The only other person I know is Steve, so I guess I'm going to his house. Okay, guys, there's his house. Go, 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 go. Girl, you better park the car. Get out of the car. Get out of the car. Okay, I'm literally gonna come over here and spam his doorbell button. Get up. Oh my gosh, guys. Thank God he's right there. He's probably watching Gordon Ramsay. He said Brooke dot, dot, dot. Okay, okay. I'm just gonna say no time to explain. Gabby is in trouble. We need help now. He said come in. Okay, okay, okay. Okay, I'm gonna tell you the quick story. Mr. Ross pretty much kidnapped us and then we went to the police and then the police turned out to be owners and now they have her captive. They're trying to put some sort of implant in me. He just said implant dot, dot, dot. Steve, we don't have time for this. We have to break Gabby out of the police station. He said, slow down. Boy, you gotta hurry. He said, okay, I think I can help. Oh my gosh, guys, thank God. He said, come with me. Okay, okay, I'm coming. Guys, why are we going upstairs? What the heck is up here? Wait, we're going into his closet, bro. This is no time to change into Gucci. Wait a second, he just pulled out a gun? Steve, I didn't know you had a gun. Guys, he's trying to give it to me. Okay, okay, I'll take it, I'll take it. Steve just said my dad was in the military. Oh my God, that's why you have this gun. Let's go get Gabby. Oh my God, guys, he's got an even bigger gun than me. Okay, okay, I'm gonna put that away. Let's go get Gabby right now. Okay, we're literally right here. I'm just gonna park the car, stop it, and get out. Go, 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 go. Guys, that sussy cop is literally at the front desk. Okay, Steve, this is gonna be the craziest stuff we've ever done before. Are you ready? He just said yes. Let's get Gabby back. Oh my God, yes. I'm ready to get my bestie back. Here we go. Put your hands up right now. Where's Gabby? He said, what are you doing? Um, I'm rescuing my bestie. He said, she's in jail. Oh, well, in that case, go in there and unlock it right now. He said, calm down. And Steve just said, release Gabby now. Mr. Ross will be upset. Um, guys, I think Mr. Ross is already upset, bro. He said, okay, okay. Open the door right now. Guys, he's opening the door. Go, 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 go. Gabby, come on. Get out here right now. Go, 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 girl. You get in the jail cell. Go. Okay, guys, I'm literally gonna close it and lock it on him. And now you get to stay in here until Mr. Ross finds you. I hope you have fun. I'm literally gonna close this door too. Gabby just said thank you so much, bestie. Okay, okay, we can thank each other later. Right now, we need to get out of town. Steve just said, of course, we couldn't leave you in there guys let's go right now guys i cannot believe my creepy teacher tried to kidnap and brainwash me the only thing we have to do now is get the heck out of town make sure you like and subscribe for more content